Uh, it's an unfortunate situation giving the timing, but really this all comes down to infrastructure. The pipes here are decades old and need millions of dollars of repairs for a permanent fix. But really the timing here is a problem. So many families just trying to get ready for Thanksgiving and all that cooking, but dealing with low water pressure. This is not a Robbins problem. This is a state and federal problem when we talk about infrastructure. A plea for help from the mayor of Robbins as the south suburb deals with water issues. About 100 homes have low water pressure. Faucets looking like this with barely anything coming out. Very pressure, you know. Uh, can't wash up. So a lot of things you can't do when you don't have water, especially Thanksgiving Day. There have been two water main breaks in the last week near 135th and Pulaski impacting water pressure. The city is working on a temporary fix to hopefully resolve the situation by tomorrow. But in the end, the mayor says aging infrastructure in the village needs about $40 million in repairs. That consists of water meters, that consists of um, six inch meter valves and um, the pumping station that can go out any day. Village leaders passing out cases of water today as those repairs continue. Every bit helps, especially for those trying to go on with that Thanksgiving cooking. It's very inconvenient because it takes you much longer to prepare your meals. I ran me some bath water, ran to the store, came back. You know, I was gone for a minute, and by the time I got back, it was ready. It's a problem we've seen elsewhere in the area. Neighboring Dixmore has faced similar problems, with leaders also calling for infrastructure upgrades. Both communities pushing for solutions and financial assistance. There are a lot of communities that's going through the same thing because the pipes are so old, and they just need to be changed. So, yeah, we need to go ahead. So again, the hope is for this temporary solution to be fixed by tomorrow. They're working on a valve of some sort. Once that's done, that will initiate some kind of reset that could follow a boil order. So it could be another more inconvenient few days for these residents. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.